Hi guys and welcome to Russian Moms, another episode with Antonina. I am Antonina. So today I want to talk about baby proofing your apartment. Well, I have a very unusual attitude towards it, I guess. Uh, because uh, we are not actually baby proofing anything. Well, of course, we have uh, walked around the apartment and looked around uh, to find. <coughs> Yo, do you want my attention or what's wrong, my dear? I will make this video quick. <laughs> so, <laughs> going back to you guys. So uh, we walked around to try to find some potentially dangerous places and um, taking away some potentially dangerous objects and that's basically it. So uh, we didn't use any specific appliances or anything of the kind. So, However, of course, uh, Lev is not very grown up yet. So. <laughs> He can't reach anything. However, today he has reached the table and he has almost grabbed a cup of coffee. So now it is getting more and more dangerous here for him in our apartment. So as for kitchen, it's not baby proof at all. So. He can open the doors easily, no problem. The only danger I think, which I really think is... Oh my god, Leo, can you please give me a couple of minutes to shoot the video? <laughs> I just wanted to show you one place which I think is really dangerous. Well, it's not that dangerous, but... I think it's not safe for Leo. Let me show you. He, Leo is trying to climb on me. Okay, let's, I am going to take it with me. Like this. So, oh my god, he's so heavy. He's more than 10 kilos now. So here we are. <laughs> Now I'm going to show you the place. Okay, here we go. Here, our little tree, Gibiscus. Uh, I'm afraid that he's going to grab a couple of handfuls of <laughs> soil and eat it or something but so far he hasn't done it so I hope that it won't change anyway that's it for today of course everyone has his own opinion on this matter baby proofing your apartment and you should be careful in some things and still do some preparations especially when your baby starts crawling and walking so but I believe that uh, the more naturally you do it the better but you should be careful still so you should follow your baby around most of the time and see that and teach him this is dangerous be careful here and there by the way I think that talking to your baby and explaining things to him is never early so you can start really early I started at the age of two months so maybe even earlier to explain things to him so talk to your baby explain show demonstrate and make sure that your baby does not hurt himself or herself so but it's up to you whether you want to use some special devices to baby proof your apartment to make the doors closed all the doors closed or maybe uh, put some things which are not dangerous for him in the lowest drawers the doors which he can open behind the doors which he can open he or she of course anyway uh, that's what I do. I just uh, try to make sure that there's nothing dangerous in the 
drawers and boxes which Leo can reach. That's it. So that's it for today. I hope that you found this video interesting and a little bit entertaining, probably. Uh, make sure to comment, tell about your opinion on this matter, and see you next time. Like, share, and subscribe. Bye. Вот так вот. Мы Льву разрешаем трогать разные вещи, исследовать их, открывать разные двери, и стараемся не сильно запрещать ему много всего. Конечно, где-то что-то мы запрещаем, объясняем, разговариваем с ним, стараемся как можно больше объяснять, потому что считаем, что Лев уже много чего понимает. Вот. Говорите со своими детьми, объясняйте. Ну и, конечно, у всех свое мнение на этот счет. Вот и все на сегодня. Кстати, Лев сегодня чуть ли не стащил чашку с кофе со стола, поэтому теперь мы будем более аккуратны, будем следить, что у нас находится на столе. Ладно, пока, ребята. Лева, пока. Помаши пока. Нет, скажи, я просто к маме поползу, поползу к маме. Не кушай. Пока-пока. Пока-пока. Пока-пока.